Thanks for having a look at this quick proof of concept to show you how we can position vent holes in crates uh, to match the pallet. So in this case we build a, a shipper here in Ardios and we are palletizing this using CAPE. So after we palletize this we will be able to see how these uh, crates, uh, how these uh, shippers are being positioned on that pallet and more specifically if these vents hole, vent holes will be covered by the wooden slates of the pallet or not. So here we're making just a quick uh, change where we allow an overhang which greatly increases the area uh, efficiency uh, as you can see here in this first solution. So sending this back and visualizing this, which we can't do here in CAPE, uh, we do using the file export and exit. Okay, so that allows us to take this solution back into Ardios and visualize precisely how these vent holes overlap or not the wooden slats in the uh, crate. So there you have it. Um, also a quick uh, word on how to build these pallets. But before we do that, again, let's use some of these inspection tools where we can zoom in really nice and up close, highlight the edges. So if these crates are stacked, as you see here, we can see that we have a perfect air circulation there and these holes are not being blocked or covered by these wooden slats of the pallet. So as mentioned, um, how can we customize these pallets? Well, for that, we go to the make new palette, palette builder dialog, where we pick the open palette and then we pick the palette we want to have a look at or we want to edit. Be careful any change you make here will alter your default. So I would advise you to copy and paste, uh, rename it and then work on this copy. So here you can see the different board parameters, length, width and height of each of these wooden slats. Uh, you can see this is built up in layers, so you can view the current layer. There are three layers, the top layer, the middle layer, and the bottom layer, and each of those, uh, you can add boards, uh, edit boards, uh, rotate these boards, the direction um, right there. If you want to find out how you can easily create these yourself, head on over to the help screen where you click on the design new palettes. And here you have a step by step instruction on how you can build or edit your own custom palettes. Hope this quick proof of concept helped and good luck. Thanks for watching this movie.